a deadly mystery at a Bay State skydiving center. An experienced jumper killed when something went horribly wrong. It happened in Pepperell this morning. Investigation is still in the early stages at this point. Our Julie Lonchak is following the latest de developments, and she joins us live in Pepperell tonight. Heather, the small Pepperell Airport closed just after this crash. The FAA is now investigating, and tonight the skydiving community is just devastated. Investigators were on scene for hours, inspecting the plane and the equipment. 37 year old Daniel Pelrin of Mattapan died Sunday morning at the Skydive Pepperell in Pepperell. He was an experienced skydiver, and at this point, authorities aren't saying what went wrong. The medical examiner says Pelrin died of blunt force trauma from the ground. Employees and friends watched on, heartbroken. This isn't the first incident involving skydive. In 2010, a man was injured after he missed his landing zone and found himself tangled in the treetops. And in 2009, a similar incident. An experienced jumper was trapped some 60 feet in the air in high winds. Pelrine grew up in Cambridge and was engaged to be married. Friends describe him as a gentle, honest, genuine person, a great guy who liked the adrenaline of jumping. And there's a small group there just beyond that tree line. They've been trying to remember their friend for about a half an hour now. Just a terrible tragedy here. A friend tells us that Pelrine had jumped more than 450 times. We're live in Pepperell, Julie Lonchak, WCBB News Center 5.